here. You said you've got 15 people, 15 calls, emergencies waiting. Why are you still standing here? Do as you're told. You're dismissed. I don't work. Get, get out of here. You're not trying to bait me? <clears throat> All right, I don't know if we'll get signal in here or not. Hello. Yeah, I was going to go outside to see the camera, and I'm like, no. I'm not here to film you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We got the blue line. Hopefully we keep signal. If not, um, we'll see. I'm going to grab a complaint form. If you guys go on uh, online and look up Independence Missouri on Google, you just read the reviews on there. This is the Independence Missouri Police Department Google listing. I'm doing this video a week or so after my visit to the department. I should have done it before my visit so that uh, I could make sure that you're seeing stuff that was there before. But luckily everything is dated so you can see what was here before. Worthless if I could give the Independence Police Department zero stars, I would. The police chief should be removed immediately for failure to perform their duties. There were several break-ins, burglaries of automobiles and thefts in the neighborhood overnight. And IPD did not even send a patrol officer to the scene to conduct site exploitation or any aspect of an investigation. This one was actually here before I went there. I remember reading it now. I would discourage even relying on the PD for anything other than traffic citations. When crimes occur and the police fail to respond adequately or at all, then criminals continue to engage in criminal misconduct. Chris Guy says, beware of the Independence PD and record every encounter. It may not help you if you wind up brain dead after being tased and slammed into pavement, but that's what you get for doing absolutely nothing wrong. Um, here's a local guide. In one day, there was an obvious and deliberate exhibition by these obnoxious and overbloated meter mines with a serious control complex to one, act in accordance outside of the law, and two, when faced with actual crime, avoid and be as completely arrogant about it as humanly possible. Now this is what I experienced as soon as I uh, came in contact with that lieutenant. Do you need a supervisor? Yeah. What is it that you need? Well, I was just curious um, if you guys are aware of the reviews on your, uh, on your department that are no. online out there. Okay. Are you familiar with the internet? Yes. Okay. I mean, you say it like... Do you, well, do you have a true need for the police department? I get it. You don't like the police and you're trying to bait us. Excuse we have me? We have 10 or 15 calls backed up and I get it that you're trying to, to bait me into this, whatever you're trying to do. I had read most of these reviews in here and I'm seeing arrogance. I'm seeing you know, that they're saying they're arrogant. I'm, I'm going to uh, scroll through this quickly, but I'll, uh, I'll leave a link to their Google page so you guys can go and read them and I'll skim through them quick. Uh, rude, lazy employees called to make a report about a crime that was witnessed. They didn't. They uh, didn't care less. Since I personally was not the victim, it said for me to just drop it. So very slow to respond to emergencies. Very, very slow. What's your name? It's Captain Bass. Captain Bass. But I have 10 or 15 emergency, true okay. emergency calls. Great. Well, you know what? That's what a lot of the complaints are about. So you know, go ahead and get back to them. And why don't you call me when you do have time? I. I'm not gonna call you. I reported that I think I had been poisoned and an hour later when I get, to, uh, when I called to get an ETA before the accused got away, I was told they were on a shift change. My call was still pending status and they were short staff. The dispatch seemed very uninterested. This is how our tax money is used. Wow, zero stars wasn't an option. Uh, worst police station ever. They gang up on you, rough one handcuffing. They have the most uncomfortable beds. Um, have to say, I was very disappointed in the de department. I was just accused of stealing from a grocery store by one of your officers on duty at High V. Um, I read this one too. He stopped the person and essentially conducted a search, um, only to find that there was nothing. Um, my family and I were in a horrible accident and the officers were wonderful. So there's some good reviews. IPD police officer Dale Daughtery ran over and dragged my son Christopher during a police chase. My son was an innocent bystander who was not involved in the chase and he paid with his life. To date, 11 years, two months later, Daughtery has not been held accountable for what he did to my son. Got a lot of wrecked cars here.
A lot of wrecked cars, wrecked police cars. IPD is a disgraceful organization full of crooks, liars, and murderers. I don't know if someone's going to help me here or not. Hi, can I help you? Uh, do you have complaint forms? Mm -hmm. All right. Independence Police Department citizens complaint form. Awesome, thank you. Is there a is there a supervisor on duty that I could speak um, to? I can get you with a sergeant. Okay, I What's appreciate it. James. James, okay. Yep. I want to actually specifically address some of the things that um, <clears throat> are posted on their Google. Howdy. Yeah. What is it that you need? Well, I was just curious um, if you guys are aware of the reviews on your uh, on your department that are no. online out there. Okay. Are you familiar with the internet? Yes. Okay. I mean, you say it like. Do you, well, do you have a true need for the police department? I get it. You don't like the police, and you're trying to bait us. Excuse we have me? we have ten or fifteen calls backed up, and I get it that you're trying to to bait me into this whatever you're trying to do. What's your name? It's Captain Bass. Captain Bass. But I have 10 or 15 emergency, true okay. emergency calls. Great. Well, you know what? That's what a lot of the complaints are about. So, you know, go ahead and get back to them. And why don't you call me when you do have time? I, I'm not going to call you. Okay. You're well, that's looking that, to, you're your, looking. your locals are complaining to me. And that's what I'm okay. trying to tell you is that there's a legitimate, a whole bunch of legitimate they, complaints they on your website. They are to come up here and fill out a complaint form. And we'll be well, it's been going on for years to. and nothing has been fixed. And so they asked me to come out here. So, and I you're, and you're already you standoffish and being aggressive towards I, I me about the fact that I'm even here. If you would like to forward me the complaints you received, I will give you an email address. Sir, you just told me you know how the internet works, right? If you would like to give me... They're public. They're on the internet. Okay, well, the internet... Google your... The Google. internet is a big place. You're right. So, if Google you your like, department. Okay. Just I'm, Google it. You know how to use Google? Yes, I know how to okay. use Google. All the complaints are there. Now, the one thing I ask you is a lot... A few of the things that are the... A few of the complaints on there are that you guys have retaliated and used excessive force. So all I'm asking is that when you do go and see those complaints, that we try to address them in a proactive way to, to um, gain the citizens' trust, because it's going to have their names on there. So, and I don't want those people retaliated against. So Well, we handled approximately, what was it, 15,000 calls last month, so you're, they're going to have okay. to narrow it down. Okay. Well, like I said, Google your department. Google has a Google listing of every business in just about every business in the U.S. They create it even if you don't create it. And well, I'm telling just, you, all I you have to figured, do is Google it. I figured since you were an activist, you may have something specific that you would like to forward me that would save plenty of time where we could get back. I to just the told you, to the you have a cell phone on you. We're in the age of information, right? Yes. Everyone has all the information in the okay. world at their fingertips. I and, asked and you if you, you know how the internet and, and, works. And, and so you're uh, interrupting me. I asked you if you know how the internet okay. works. You said yes. Do you yes. have something else that you would like? As we no, that's that's I, like I told up. you when you first got here. Okay, I'm here will, to address the complaints of your, your citizens, complaint. and you have been rude since you got here. I, you I, have you walked up and automatically assumed, oh, you hate cops and you're here to cause a problem. So anytime someone criticizes you, they're here to cause a problem. You, sir, Mr. Bass, are the problem. I, I was, I you know, I came out here. I was polite to everyone in this entire city, in this entire okay. state, until you approached me. You are the problem. You are the complaint. How you doing, sir? Do you, Marriott. I'm you? James. How are you? Good. Sergeant Marriott. I'm doing all right. How are you, man? Good. All right. Do you feel better, James? Is there you anything know, else that I can do? Bass, like I said, man, I don't I'm, like your attitude right off you, the bat, and you're the. Well, I already told you, and you're not listening. Either I'm that, listening you're listening, you. but you're not you told hearing. Told me that the public doesn't like the police department. They're afraid we're going to retaliate that there's been complaints of excessive force and asked me if I knew how to use Google to look it up. Well, I do know how to use Google. Okay. I do know how to use a computer. Okay. I will be glad to look it up. Awesome. And is there anything else we can no, do? No, and can we, we address it in a proactive way then? In a way that's not retaliate? Because when you came up to me automatically, 
you're upset with me because I have a complaint for the police department. And you call that baiting or trying to cause a problem. Well, so can we take a, you're a looking positive? You're put this on the internet. It's already on the internet. That you're is, live. That is what you're looking to, you're looking to bait Should the people not see it? Let me see? finish talking. Okay. You're interrupting me. All right. If there is something that you have that specifically that I can address, I will be more than glad to look into it. Can, I am the captain of this watch. I will be glad to look into any problems and any issues that you have. You keep saying that, but again, your attitude is the problem. My when, attitude that I, I promised to look into your, your complaint? Well, yeah, I've, I've told you what it is. We're just going to okay. go in circles, but you know how to look it up now. I knew Will you be proactive before. in looking it up, or do I have to, you know, hand feed you? I have to spoon feed you all the information. It would be helpful to save time. It wouldn't. Do you have a phone on you? Yes, I do. Can I see it? Absolutely not. <laughs> is it a smartphone? Yes, it is. Okay. So usually a smartphone has a little G on it. You can actually push it and just speak into it and say Independence Police Department. It, your phone will literally, without you doing anything, you can speak into it and it will literally pull that stuff up for you. Does that make sense? Yes. Okay, do you want me to show you how to do it? Absolutely not. Because here's how I see it. If you don't know how to do it today, then I can just be proactive in teaching you how to do it. And then in the future, you'll, I, I can teach you how to navigate the web Sir, in, in ways that... You don't have to patronize me. No, I'm not patronizing you. Yes, you are you. absolutely patronizing You told me, me sir, that you don't know how to do it. I did not tell There's you nothing that. wrong sir, with that. I, I if nobody taught me how to drive, I probably wouldn't know how to drive. Sir, I Nobody's did. taught you how to navigate the internet. I'll sir, teach you how. It's not a big deal. Is I, it a big deal? I did computer forensics for the FBI for five years. <laughs> I did computer forensics for the FBI for five years. I can navigate the, the FBI internet. is a joke. I don't mean to patronize. Now I'm patronizing you, but the FBI okay. is a joke. Well, Come on, man. Okay. Did you? They got a. They got a warrant for my emails. All my secret stuff is on Snapchat. Sir, there are people. They don't even have, know what Snapchat there are people is. People that have real emergencies. All right, then you get out of here. You're first. dismissed. I am. Your not, attitude I'm, was piss poor. This is exactly what the complaints are about. You can get back to work because I'm actually done with you. You are the type of officer uh, that we want off the department. But you can get back to work. Okay. You're dismissed. I'm dismissed. You are dismissed. Okay. You are no longer needed here. You never were, honestly, and, and the reviews show it. Okay. Um, I'm sure that there's good officers in this department. Okay. I am sure of it. And you, sir, are a piece of trash. Okay. Okay? You can, you can carry on. Get out of here. You said you've got 15 people, 15 calls, emergencies waiting. Why are you still standing here? Do as you're told. You're dismissed. I don't work Get you. Get out of here. You're not trying to bait me? You're the one who came up with a bad attitude. Uh, that's not true, but if, if you want, if it makes you feel better and your viewers feel better, <clears throat> by all means, beat me. My up. viewers feel better when I have positive interactions with I'm, people. The, the, the ratings show it. You're not the first guy I've been doing this job 30 years. If it makes you feel better and mm -hmm. it gets you your your likes, mm -hmm. by all means, beat me. Yeah, up. I get I get uh, better responses when I have positive interactions and, and with sell cops. Your ads, whatever you got to yeah. do. Yeah, so I get better responses when I don't run into pieces of shit like you. So. Okay. I get well, way better responses. Okay. I get way better views. Not only that, but did you know that uh, I could get a ton more views and clicks if I did a back the blue? You know the majority backs the blue, right? They do. Right? But so you what don't. you're saying is that I'm, I'm trying to do this to get clicks or likes or something. Yeah. But I would get a hell of a lot more if I just bent down and kissed your boots right now. I really would. Bootlicker? Is yeah, that, is that where yeah that's that? exactly right. And, yeah. and you and I both know that since the majority likes that, uh -huh. I would get more views, more clicks. So this obviously has nothing to do with it. This conversation has gone nowhere and will go nowhere. And I've realized that quite a while ago. Since I can't really see anything good or productive ever coming out of this encounter, I decided to start using free speech that some people would consider undesirable just to see if the tyrant would allow it to happen. It has to do with the fact that you're a piece of I came out here to talk, have a civil conversation with you. You were automatically, right off the bat, uh, rude, abrasive, and, and acted as if, because like I have right it, now? Oh, I understand, like yeah, you're being right yeah, now? you better believe it. Now okay. kick rocks and get out of here, piece of trash. Okay, well kick bricks, your car's up there. Go on. I'll stay here. Okay, well, you're more than welcome to hang out with us. All right, you're going to stay here while you got calls waiting? Yep. It's Independence uh, Police, and... Man, I gotta say, I really thought that when I came out with the camera that they would at least be good for the camera. I really thought they would at least be good for the camera. That is not what you were hoping for. Absolutely not what you were Shut up, you for. piece of shit. <laughs> when I tell you to shut your mouth, you shut your mouth, bitch. How's, how's it going?
that guy don't work here. You don't gotta. It doesn't matter. Him. It doesn't matter. I just document. Well, film to your heart's content. Yeah, I already know. Get the f out of here, you dirty f***ing pig. <laughs> <laughs> Sit on the curb, you f***ing cunt. Yeah, that, if it makes you feel better, man, let me have it. Hey. I've been doing this job 30 years. All right, so now this guy's going to walk around behind me. He's been doing it for 30 years, but 30 years ago, there wasn't cameras. 30 years ago, they didn't have to teach pigs how to act. Now they do. And this dirty mother doesn't know how to act. Never been here in my life, you lying sack of If you want to have a civil conversation, I came with a legitimate thing to talk about. I'd be more than happy to have it with you or any of your other officers. This piece of shit needs to be off the department. But uh, you guys are going to back the blue, blue line thing, you know. Don't uh, hang with the gang. Complaint. Hang with the gang. What's that? Don't forget to fill out that complaint. Yeah, don't forget to go f*** your mother. Okay. All right. The reviews from people on Google can be substantiated by a couple of videos that are on the internet of the conduct of Independence Missouri Police Department. Some of them are so graphic that I won't even show the full video on this channel, but I'll leave a link in the description so that you can go see, including the one where a 17-year-old kid was tased for 23 seconds, put into a coma, and then dropped on his head on a curb. Dude, he tastes the f out of me. Yeah, I'm I know. I've seen that. I've seen that. Four times. Four times. I know you fool. This is some bull. In it. Now. No, no, I can still can record. I can still yeah. record. I'm going to still record. Your car over They're about there. To, he's about to throw you to the hey, ground. Hey, 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 out. Walmart wants you to leave. You're trespassing. Okay, so. You need to go, okay? Are you going to leave? Yeah, I'm about to leave. I'm just, I'm just recording, my friend. I'm That's just fine. Recording I need you to leave. leave. Walmart has asked you to leave. I'm gonna ask you one more time to get in your car and leave, or you're going to jail for trespassing. Do you understand? Yeah, I do understand. All right. I know. I got it. Okay. Make sure you drive straight off the property. All right. Thank you. Is this one open? Huh? Yeah, what are you doing? Get out. For what? Out. Now. For what? Out. Hey, am I under arrest? Get out. Am I under arrest? No. no. Out. I'm going to pull you out if you don't come out. Pardon me a second. Get out. You really want to get tased right here in the middle of your For car? What? Get I haven't done anything. Off I get it you don't like the police and you're trying to bait us. Excuse we have me? we have ten or fifteen calls backed up and I get it that you're trying to, to bait me into this whatever you're trying to do.